Hi everyone and welcome back to Happy at Home. Today I'd like to share with you how I made this rustic farmhouse sign for my kitchen. The supplies I needed for this project was a board cut to size, two different colors of craft paint, some paint brushes, a stencil, and some sandpaper. I wanted my sign to look very rustic so I chose a rough cut board which I removed from an old palette. The next step was to simply paint my board using my base color. Once the base color had time to dry, I took some sandpaper and distressed the edges of the board. I then added my second paint color. Using a very thin layer of paint, I applied it only to the middle section of the board where I wanted my stenciled letters to be placed. After waiting for the paint to dry, I took my sandpaper and distressed the newly painted section. Now for the fun part, adding the stenciled letters. To begin stenciling, I found the middle letter of the word I was going to apply. I then centered that letter in the middle of my board. Then I simply added the paint in very thin layers using a stippling brush. Allowing each letter to dry slightly before adding the next letter, I moved my way down the board adding letters until I finished the sign. Once the stenciling was dry, I took my sandpaper one last time to distress each letter. And finally, I used a microfiber cloth to remove all the dust. The finished sign looks like this. I placed a new sign on the cupboards above my kitchen sink and I am loving the new look. To create a display for my new sign, I started by layering a large enamelware pan with an oval shaped cutting board behind it. On either side of the sign I placed a large glass milk bottle. This created a simple display to show off my newly painted sign. I hope you enjoyed today's project and I will see you again soon in my next video. Bye now!